With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, today's question is, it is a paragraph about fuel cell. Fuel cell are galvanic cell in which chemical energy of fuel cell is directly converted into electrical energy. A type of fuel cell is hydrogen oxygen fuel cell. It consists of two electrodes made of two porous graphite impregnated with a catalyst platinum, silver or metal oxide. The electrodes are placed in aqua solution of NaOH. Oxygen and hydrogen are continuously fed into the cell. Hydrogen get oxidized to H positive ion which is neutralized by OH negative ion that is anodic reaction. These are the reaction. Hydrogen is giving 2H positive plus 2 electron, 2H positive plus 2OH negative giving 2H2O. 2H2 plus 2OH negative giving 2H2O plus 2 electron. At cathode, oxygen is get reduced to OH negative. O2 plus 2H2O plus 4 electron giving 4OH negative. Hence, the net reaction is 2H2 plus O2 giving 2H2O. At cathode, oxygen is getting reduced to OH negative. The overall reaction has delta H value minus 285.6 kJ per mole and delta G value minus 237.4 kJ per mole at 27 degree centigrade. What is the value of delta S naught for the fuel cell at 25 degree centigrade? The question is solved using equation delta G naught is equal to delta H naught minus T delta S naught. In the question we are given delta G naught equal to minus 237.4 kJ per mole. And delta H naught value is minus 285.6 kJ per mole. Temperature is given. Temperature is 298 Kelvin. Putting these value in the equation, we get 237.4 equal to minus 285.6 minus 298 multiplied by delta H naught. Or minus 298 delta H naught would be minus 237.4 plus 285.6 or minus delta S naught is equal to minus 237.4 plus 285.6 divided by 298. On solving this equation, we get delta S naught equal to 237.4 minus 285.6 divided by 298 or minus 48.2 divided by 298 kilojoule per Kelvin. But all options are here in Joule per Kelvin. So, delta S naught is equal to minus 48.2 divided by 298 multiplied by 10 raised power 3 Joule per Kelvin. On solving this, we get minus 161 Joule per Kelvin. So, the nearest possible answer for this question is option 2, minus 160 Joule per Kelvin. This is the solution for this question. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.